Let me show y'all something, right? I'm going to show y'all a pattern of why we shouldn't believe what we were told. Nothing, okay? Now, a lot of people tell girl, you're talking crazy. No, if you want to believe somebody's telling you something, you have to check their credibility, okay? Now, I don't have a lot of education, how some of y'all got, but I got Audrey Johnson's, and where she get her bloodline from, I got her common sense. So why am I so close up on the camera? Because when you about to sell, tell somebody something that's going to shame them, you get up close on them. And you whisper it so they can take it well. Hey. Hey. You're being stupid. Go somewhere and sit down. Listen. Get y'all mind right. You understand me? A lot of y'all out there worrying about how you look on the outside. Get your spirit right. Because some stuff is coming. Some stuff is coming. Listen. Let me show y'all this pattern. Alright? Let me get to it. Because you know I lose track. Right? Because I think I got where I want to start from. I've been working on it. <laughs> Listen to this now. First, they were saying that everybody, Europeans, started everybody in the world. That's what we were taught. Now, Christopher Columbus, everybody found everybody. And and everybody came from, from uh, white people was the true Christianity. Europeans was the true people. And they were Christian people. And we evolved from monkeys. Remember that now. I'm not the only one. Then they start to say that uh, 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 that that when they found the first people, uh, the first person, the oldest person, and it was a black woman, then they start to change it now, right? And say we had them in slavery in Kemet, right? Yeah, it was we were the only one there, so we had to have them in slavery, the so-called Jews, and they must they were supposed to, we were supposed to enslave them who built the pyramids. That's what they told y'all now. Now I'm not the only one they told this to. So don't no, act like I'm talking about some made up stuff. I'm telling you facts now. I'm just repeating this to you. I want to show you the people who you believe in credibility. Okay? So y'all can stop your bullshit, okay? Is this just between me and you? If you want to tell somebody, that's up to you. Okay? Then they say everybody came from the black woman, and we had them in slavery, and they the one who built the pyramids. Right? Now, then they start to say that everybody evolved from monkeys. Okay? Now, this is what's going on now. Then, now, right? Remember now, Jesus was supposed to come back in 2000. He was going to open the sky and judge the world. Not Jesus now, God. Because remember, at first, the church told us that Jesus was the Son of God. And in order to uh, get to God, you had to go through Jesus. What is she talking about? Monkeys, Jesus, everything. There's no difference. Religion is spiritual, supposed to be spirituality, and science is the same thing because science is just reading nature. That's it. Now, balance it out. I'm, I'm trying to go slow for y'all. Now, I'm going to show y'all some. Now, then they started to talk about, no, Jesus is God. They are one. Him, the Holy Spirit, and God. That's when they figure that out. Then that's when they start teaching everybody. Now that's what everybody's saying, right? Now Jesus is God because him and God are one. Two men and a spirit are one. Even though he came from a virgin vagina. Somehow Mary's vagina went back virgin after she had her children. Because remember, Jesus wasn't the first one. We ain't reading that Medunetta right. Anyway, I ain't going to go there with you. I'm just showing you their credibility now. Okay? Now, on top of that now, right? After all of that, now everybody's evolved from monkeys, and we had people in slavery, and, and whatever, whatever. That's probably the reason we were in slavery. They put us in slavery. <laughs> Wait a minute. Now, right? Jesus hasn't come yet. Hear what they're saying now. The aliens, they found drawings on the, on the walls in Kemet, in what they call Egypt, of knowing that aliens help 
the Egyptians build the pyramids. Now that it's been proven that Cushites built the pyramids and not by slavery, <laughs> it was aliens who helped us. You think I'm joking? This is historical fact, man. These people have came on TV, the Navy, and said that aliens exist. The Navy, nobody's talking about it now. Now, these are the people who rule in the world now. And they're telling you that aliens exist. And they have flying saucers. Now that they are in control of all type of illusion and confusion in their takeaway knowledge, what they call technology. Now that they know that you, they could even bomb the World Trade Center and make it look like planes flew into it. And everybody still believe it. That it happened that way. And the government ain't had nothing to do with it. Now that they know that they can do that. What do you think they're going to bring from space? Why do you think they're having space wars up there? Did you know China, Russia, and America was fighting over space? Airspace. Outer space. They have started fighting already out there. We ain't even fully made it there yet. You hear what's going on? And y'all down here twerking, man. Listen. <laughs> Meanwhile, Canada has legalized sex with animals. You see, we ain't calling a dog a dog. Hmm? When we see it, we like to sit back and be and just be a part of the crowd because we don't want to be an individual. That means you're going to have to stand on your own. And you are responsible for every action and decision you make. And you know we don't want that. We want somebody to die on the cross for our sins. Look. Somebody has to die for your sins. Why don't you just stop your sins? Hello? We done sat here so long and let these people give us Satan for God. Tell us, put us all together as mammals you know they taught us that in school. Now everybody I can like animals. And the animals I can like people. Because they living in nature. Unless we take them out of it. So who are the people are the animals? So in the beginning. So shall it be in the end. I ain't get that from education, you know. This wisdom. This third eye. It come from before, before. Passed down to me through my granny, Audrey Mae Johnson. Had no education. I haven't met no spirit that's in their high places. In this system that is higher than Audrey. She grew me. When mom and dad was on crack, they tried to put us in the home. My grandma got off that bean field bus full of muck. We ran to her. Down from Red and Right building. Y'all know me. Heard me. Grandma say, where's eyes sleeps? They sleeps. What's eyes eat? They eat. These my grandbabies. They ain't going nowhere. Humanity. 
Now they got y'all niggas out here hanging on this cross. Telling y'all, y'all monkeys. And out of space, green people gonna come down here. One Asian man, it is documented. They got this man books and all type of money talking to him, talking about an alien woman came down 10 feet tall, huh? With braided hair on her legs. You can look this shit up. I'm not making this up. This is from their scientific facts. The same people who is giving you God and giving you education. She came down with long braided hair on her legs. The only thing different from her, from humans, is she had six toes and six fingers. And here's, here's where the story diverts. He had sex with the female alien for 40 minutes. The little Asian man. Now you tell me these highly intelligent beings came from outer space, highly intelligent. And all the men on the world, she chooses a little Asian man to have sex with. And for only 40 minutes. he I, I don't know if he timed it or why 40 minutes. You know, I don't. What were they doing in that 40 minutes with a strange alien being? I mean, why was it timed? And so happened, he said, he seeded a son. But they say he would never see his son until later future. When he's ready to come back to the earth. Listen, y'all, Chinese people have been making people a long time. Listen, you got real people. You can look them in their windows, their eyes, and you can tell when they're real. And you got fake people. Listen, these people have been cloned, man. Listen to me. Hello. This is plain foolishness these people are doing and talking about. And they are over your education. They are teaching your children just as they taught you. First, they didn't want you to read until they fixed them books. Remember, they burnt them books. Way back, way back. Why were they burning books? They were searching all over Africa, trying to take Kushalan, trying to take all of the artifacts and burn them. Hmm? Now they give you your books and you done lost your mind. These the same ones that tell you man and man together and woman and woman together is right it's okay it's their choice as long as, as long as it make them happy don't do what's right just make you happy people like to murder and rape children that makes them happy should we go along with that too Wisdom over education. 40 minutes. I can't get over that. 40 minutes with an Asian man. Come on. Let's be real. You really think she going to pass up all the Mendingos, 10-foot woman, huh? For a hollow little Asian man. Let's be real. Let's be real. And 40 minutes. What were they doing? And who was timing? 40 minutes. Don't let... Is it? You see? All on TV. Sex, 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 sex. You don't see it. That's why everybody running around fucking everybody. Just... I'm, I'm telling you. Look at it. Alien just got here. And he fucking. You see what I'm saying? You didn't have no questions. That's probably why they ain't been back yet. She picked the wrong one. She went up there and said, you see how he represented us down here, gal? You see this? She picked the wrong one. So he need to get back in c t contact with her and let her know that there was, there was better here. <laughs> I don't know. Y'all niggas crazy, so I might as well talk on it. I might as well talk crazy with you. You understand? <laughs> UFOs, Bill, ancient Kimmy. Man, let me tell you something, man. Y'all better wake up. I got to go. My king calling me now.